Kyle, you are taking all of these questions and you have answers tonight. What are these people more than likely experiencing? Yeah, Matthew, I heard it last night too when I got home and it's something called frost quakes, which is uh, not something that's very common across our portion of the country. Kind of take you back here through time exactly what happened Thursday evening. Remember we had that rain coming down. We had temperatures which were in the 50s and then as we went throughout Thursday night and into Friday morning, a drastic drop in those temperatures. We changed over to a little bit of that wintry mix numbers that dropped below freezing and that water from the rain that got into the ground started to freeze. Well, then last night we got even colder. We got those temperatures down into the single digits and so that water that's been in the ground has been freezing and as that ice expands puts more stress on the ground and so we get these little what are called frost quakes and so they start to expand and once that stress is relieved we start to hear that popping sound and some people have said you know it sounds like it's coming from the attic well that sound traveling from great distances at times so it may sound like it's coming from just about anywhere and also the houses are settling a little bit too we're heating the interior but then areas like the attic things are a little bit colder there. So those are a couple of different reasons that we're hearing those and may hear a couple more as we go into tonight. All right.